What's up guys, Brunsnick's back and I brought the goat with me because we're going to be talking about the new blue hammer on short patterns. Now I got a lot of inquiries about how this ball will do on patterns it was designed for, something like urethane. Well this ball is not urethane, so how is this ball going to do on a PBA wolf pattern? The shortest pattern I can find, 34 feet. We're going to get to that and we're going to talk about it, but before we do, please subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. Now. Let's see what New Blue Hammer does on the PBA Wolf pattern. All right, we're here. I'm with the goat, because he's the king of playing the gutter, and I think that's what I'm gonna have to do today. So we have the New Blue Hammer. I put it back to box surface. 500, 1,000 have used it a lot this last week between the videos, comparisons, and of course, bowling league with it. So I have put out PBA Wolf pattern. This is a 34 foot pattern, short pattern, you know, this is something that you'll typically see purple hammers on on tour, and boy were they. So I'm going to throw some shots. We got Specto running, so I'm going to look at some of the data along the way. But I haven't thrown a single shot today, so this is going to be like the lights going on, warming up time. This is from the start, so no warm up. Just going to warm up and uh, see, and we'll start making our way out to the gutter there. So let's see it. Yeah, I don't typically do videos where I go in cold, but in the sake of making this as legit as possible, so this is just like, you know, you get your 10 minutes of warm up in a PBA event or whatever, or whatever tournament you might be bowling in. We're gonna see how good this ball is on short patterns, because that's exactly what it's designed for, right? So it always takes a few shots, you know, obviously urethane, if we were to try that right now. Let's give it a shot one sec. If we were to try urethane out there and likely hook a lot earlier and quicker right off the spot from the first shot. <laughs> That's just how urethane goes. First shot, doesn't matter. Second shot, it's gonna hook us half as much. Third shot, it's gonna be about where you wanna be. So we don't typically, I don't see that too much with the new blue compared. Because it's not urethane, it's not as susceptible. The surface doesn't give you that big pop off the front and early and hook a lot. All right, let's get real. Let's start amping up the speed a little bit. Okay. Now it's going to be imperative that ball speed is going to be high and I'm going to have to play close to the gutter. So it's going to take me a few shots to get warmed up and get stretched out and ready to go to play out there. But we're going to see just how viable an option New Blue is playing out. And I got the goat on my side. He's the king of playing out. Is that a red ball up five? Blue ball. Okay. Yeah. Starting to get the rhythm now. I've been spoiled playing here for quite a while. This whole year, I just put out crown jewel pattern pretty much, test medium. You know, tons of friction to the right. This one obviously has a ton of friction, but the difference between this pattern and say crown jewel, which is 43 feet, is I'm not gonna be able to move in and hook it. Because if I try playing a line like I did in most videos, say I'll try it here, where I move in to say like, you know, stand around 20 and try to throw it out, let's see what happens. Ball encounters friction just a little bit too early and does too much work. So I'd be fighting that. I'd be fighting the ball speed, trying to play in to throw it out to the gutter where I'll throw it past the pocket more often and be battling that friction. So it's always best to play up the boards, way up by the gutter on a short pattern, especially like Wolf. That is, if you wanna win. If you don't wanna win, then move in, I don't care. All right, that last shot we wrapped 10. 
when I was playing it out, let's see what we got here. Uh, any questions, comments? I mean, I think that's it, right? That's the shot you want to play with urethane. A lot of speed out by the gutter. Sets up about 35 feet. Access the pattern, smooth. Let's try it again. Now 500, 1000 grit is the box surface, which is dull. But when we're talking like urethane, some of those guys hit those balls with only 500. That's hooking, hook. Yeah. All right. So you've seen a lot of these reviews where the guys that throw urethane quite a bit are hitting them with more surface. So they say, hey, you know, I, I see this new blue is just a smidge longer. You know, it doesn't set up as much. That's a purple hammer. So, you know, they're gonna adjust the surface. And the other thing you're gonna have to do with new blue that you want you maybe not do as often with purple is surface management a little bit more because it's not urethane. It's not gonna hold that surface as well as urethane. I never touched mine and it still looks like the day I got it. All right, I'm gonna throw a couple shots with purple hammer out there just so we can see how they do side by side. Because I love a good urethane ball. I am not a PBA member. I don't bowl PBA tournaments. So purple hammer is still legal. It's staying in my bag. All right, so we threw that first shot. And then wipe the oil off. I just want to see what it'll do with the little bit still on there. Uh oh, that's in. Got it in a little bit. Held pocket. Nice. Let's throw a couple more shots. I really want to flirt with the gutter here. Let's really get it out there. You got to test the limits, especially on a short pattern. You got to be able to create the most entry angle possible on a short pattern. And you can only really do that by playing out by the gutter. That's it. No ifs, ands, or buts. You gotta play out by the gutter. All right, let's try that again. Oh man, that's hooks. A lot earlier out there. So yeah, I mean, I see it too. Purple hammer's a lot earlier. I'm gonna have to play a little bit more ball speed than I would than a new blue. So let's try it, let's see how much more speed it's gonna take. I felt like those are in the same range of where I've been throwing. I'm not really throwing it any different than I did new blue, so. Let's try that again. That was out a little bit closer to the edge. Let's just throw it a little harder. Okay, and then you, then you throw it through it a little bit. So there's a little fine area there where you gotta overpower it a little bit with urethane while you're trying to blend it out. Which is fine, I can do it. I'm just gonna stay aggressive with the speed. I'm just gonna tip the hand a little bit more around the side. Get that ball off that spot harder. That's all it takes. All right, let's go back to new blue. That's why we're here. We threw some shots of purple. Obviously, very good option. Obviously. So, let's switch back over new blue. Should be nice and blended in there now. We'll see. I'm gonna stay in the same spot. I'm gonna try to throw this shot the exact same speed and revs that I just did with the purple. Almost a fast eight. I can see it doing a little bit more work, has a little bit more flair, sets up and kind of continues a little bit. But right there, I can live with a four pin 
I'm in the zone. That's the main things we're going to be looking at, and that's going to be the true test of this ball come competition time. Ah. Got a little lazy out there. Is how well this ball is going to keep everybody in the pocket when the lanes are tough. That's the thing. Purple Hammer is so good is because one, it hooks on pretty much anything, and two, it keeps them in the pocket. It takes some of the pattern equation out of play where they can just do their thing, match up the surface, get in the zone, and stay there. All right. Come on, let's strike with this. So far I went fast, eight through the face. I'm gonna move in like two. Yes. So I can swing just a little bit more, I think, with new blue versus purple. I'm liking it. Now, when I bowled a lot more, when I bowled on regionals when I was a member, I love patterns of play by the gutter. In fact, I defaulted to the gutter. I'm most comfortable playing out there. I like playing speed. I like playing less angle. That's it. I'm gonna score better when I'm out here. All right, let's throw another shot there. That's in. Got it in just a little bit compared to the last one, but kept me in the zone, friction, guided it back to the pocket. So I don't think there's much of a question now after a few weeks of new blue being out there with new videos being out there that this is gonna be a very good option on the PBA Tour to replace Purple Hammer. It's gonna be an option. As for everybody in USB-C, you can still use Purple Hammer, sure, but New Blue is gonna be there to give you just a slightly different look, but keep you in the same area. Let's throw one or two more shots and we'll wrap this up. Much thanks to the Max Lane machine there for putting down PBA patterns for me. All I do is just dial it in call it down from the cloud and it puts it down. That's going. Banking it off the gutter. Yeah. There's a lot of hype around this ball and it's well deserved. I'm telling you, new blue, short patterns. I don't know, what do you guys think? I think it's pretty dang good. All right, one more shot. Let's just, uh, let's just get a nice tasty crunchy strike here and call it a day. Little wide pocket there, so we'll see what we can do with it. That's hooking. Ah. All right. Didn't think I was gonna strike with that rack. I was right. Let's do it one more time. Let's try to call my shot. Um, I'm gonna go light mixer. I wanna send the head pin across the deck. How about that? I wanna mix up some pins, all right? I'm just gonna stay a little bit more firm to do that in the same zone. Ah, well. Guess I'm not Babe Ruth after all. Can't call my shot. Best I could do is dead flush, but the A9. But that's new blue hammer on PBA Wolf pattern, courtesy of the GOAT, because he is the best at playing up that area. Best there ever was. So, you got any questions, comments, anything else you want to say? Put them down in the comments below. Talk to you guys soon. Please subscribe.